In this video, we'll show you how to save a storyline project as a .story template to be reused in future projects. To save this storyline project as a template with slides that I can insert into future courses, all I need to do is come to the File dropdown and Save As. And instead of saving it as a .story file, I'm instead going to change this dropdown, the Save As type, to instead save it as a storyline template, which is the .story template extension. And I tend to save mine in the automatically created My Articulate Projects folder. And that folder should also contain a folder called Storyline Templates. And once I save it there, it's now saved as a template with slides that I can insert into future projects. And there are a couple of different ways that I can do that. And the first way is from the Storyline Start screen. Before I even open a new project, I can import from that story template that I've saved. When I choose this option, it will take me right to my template library, select that template, and this will open up and give me the ability to choose which slides I want to insert into my course. My template is saved with different scenes in it, but if I want to just choose some of those slides, I can hold down the control key and pick the slides that I want. I can choose to insert them into the current scene or a new scene in a new project, or even import the scenes that were created in that template project. I'll put them into the current scene and import those slides into my new course. If I already have a new course open and I haven't imported from that main start screen of Storyline, all I need to do here is be on the Slides tab within Storyline. When I choose Import, I can choose to Import Storyline. Again, it takes me right back out to my Storyline Templates folder, select that item, and I have the same screen with the options of what slides I want to include into this project. I can select all, select none, or hold down my control key to choose just the slides that I want.